Faithy. Welcome back to my channel and today I will be reviewing the November Loot Crate box. Okay, so Loot Crate is a monthly subscription that is, I want to say $13.99 um, and it includes shipping and handling if that's not right. I'm going to put a little insert right there because I kind of just blinked out on the price. So every month, Loot Crate sends out a variety of collectibles um, that center around a theme that pull in from different um, fandoms and um, genres in the kind of geek, in the geek realm. So this month's theme is magical. So here is a little magazine that you get in the Loot Crate box. And it says, magical. Test your fantastic beast knowledge. And it also has, it's like also um, a gift guide. Oh, this is so cute at the back. You see what it says? It says, we love you. So Loot Crate loves you. Okay. Breathe, focus, harness your energies and cast a spell. Behold, you have conjured this very magical crate. To assist you as you head into a world of mystical incantations and arcane adventures, we've packed this month's magazine with all sorts of spellbinding goodies. Study the various religions in HBO's Games of Thrones, discover outworldly artifacts from Doctor Strange, and an interview with the real-life ma magician illusionist Joseph Realm. I hope I'm saying that right. Plus, we've got our first ever gift guide. Good luck, looters, and remember, life's adventures can be perilous, but with a little magic on your side, anything is possible. And so they also have kind of just a bunch of extras. That's what it looks like. And of course, every every loot crate box turns into something. So you see here, here are the instructions on how to transform your crate. And it says to make it like a little potion shelf actually if you kind of look right there so all right so let's get into the box so yeah if you can see here the box this is part of the crate that will be transformed into a little potion shelf okay so the first item is a t-shirt from fantastic beast and where to find them can you see that it says, become an Obliviator, recruiting now every half moon of the month. Sorry, I'm reading this literally through the viewfinder of the camera backwards. So that's very cool. I just saw it, and it's a great movie, so. And I, you know, I really like getting the t-shirts in the box. I think that's always a, a nice, neat little um, collectible. Ooh. The next item is one of the loop pins that you get every month. And this month, this month's loot pin is from the Elder Scrolls. I'm going to take it out of the package so you can see it. Now, I know if you go online, you're supposed to be able to unlock exclusive content from the Elder Scrolls. And I think there's more instructions. See that? Isn't that pretty? Inside the little, inside the little magazine. Alright, so the next item inside the box is a um, Q-Fig collectible um, from Doctor Strange. And this is a Loot Crate exclusive, so I'm going to take it out of the box because it's really hard to see the packaging. So a lot of people love the Q-Fig collectibles because they're more realistic and kind of a little bit more lifelike than the actual um, Pop Funkos. I know my brothers love them, so my brothers will definitely be getting this. And it's really nice. Yeah, and this is, like I said, it's, um, it's a Loot Crate exclusive. Alright, so... I don't know, I guess this is in here, I didn't notice this was in here, but it's just a, a membership card to Loot Crate and it says, I'm going to cover this, but it has your membership number and right there. Um, I don't know, I'll have to look in the magazine real quick at the end to see if that unlocks something, but 
The next item in the box is a Game of Thrones journal. You see that it says the night is dark. Sorry, it's super reflective. And then the back it says full of tears. So this is really nice. Um, we'll have to admit that I am a journal diary person. Not so much to the point that I actually write journals and diaries. I just like to collect the notebooks for them and they kind of, I write like two days worth and then never ever use them again or just use them for completely other purposes. But this is something that's really nice and I will definitely add to my obscene notebook journal collection. So the next item is, oh, this is really nice. It's another Loot Crate exclusive. It is a Big Trouble in Little China comic. <laughs> And it says Escape from New York. So now, again, giving away my age, there's probably a lot of you guys who don't know anything about this movie, but Big Trouble in Little China was this great little um, movie that came out in the, I'm going to say mid to late 80s, uh, starring Kurt Russell, uh, much, much younger Kurt Russell. And it's kind of a cheesy, over-the-top sci-fi movie with sort of quote-unquote oriental themes, you know, the Chinese magic and witchcraft going on, but it's, you know, obviously it's kind of meant to be over the top, very exaggerated, but it's a great movie, and um, for me, it was definitely one of my favorite movies growing up, so it's definitely nostalgic for me, and I will definitely be reading that, but that's so cool. I have that movie on DVD. It's not the best quality, because obviously I think they literally just ripped it from the VHS, but still. So, oh, let me show you the inside of the box. So, like I said, every month you can transform your box into something else. Alright, let me run through this real quick. So, yeah, Strange Artifacts, Fantastic Beast. Oh, and so they also have kind of a little kind of reminder to buy the exclusive South Park Special Edition crate that Loot Crate has coming out in December. I am getting that box and I will be reviewing it as soon as I get it. Um, but word to the rise, it's really expensive. It's $6.99 plus shipping and handling. So I think with everything it comes out to 80 bucks, it was super expensive. I actually kind of had to split the cost with my brother so we're splitting the box um, because that was the only way we could make it really palatable because that's it's that's a lot of money for a box and we're hoping that it's that it's really awesome. God, please let it be awesome. But anyway, so this is Game of Thrones, blah blah blah. There's a crossword in here. Oh, and then there's the okay, yeah, here we go. Elder Scrolls Online, Imperial Edition upgrade and collector's pen. And it says this exclusive pen that unlocks special Elder Scrolls gameplay. And it says to redeem your Imperial Edition upgrade code. So you have to have the game, obviously. And it says, use the free code um, below, you redeem it, and then you get like uh, a complimentary game update. So that's, um, I, I don't play Elder Scrolls, but if that's something that you're into and you have, I think this would be a really nice addition. Let's see, Illusionist, Magician Guy, Trick, and then the little Loot Crate gift for that. Oh, they're also having a Hello Kitty loot crate. Hmm. That's kind of interesting. And of course, they got a little advertisement for Assassin's Creed in there. So, alright, so to recap, uh, Big Trouble in Little China comic, Game of Thrones journal, loot pin, Fantastic Beast shirt and the Doctor Strange Q fig figure. So all in all, actually I think for $13.99 that was this is actually a really good um, box. Um, I will say though the theme though, kind of unless you're really familiar with all of these things, the sort of magic theme, you kind of have to like look more than the surface, but. Um, especially some of the items that they chose specifically to represent this theme was kind of, I think, stretching a little bit. But, like I said, I still like this and, um, you know, with the exception of sort of Elder Scrolls, 
I'm a fan of all these things. So I really liked it. I really enjoyed it. Um, let me know down in the comments uh, below if you liked this month's Loot Crate and what was your favorite item. If you liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button below. Um, I have all my social media listed down below in the description box. And as always, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And since it's Thanksgiving, I hope you guys have a very wonderful Thanksgiving. Bye.